Welcome to another Exchange 316 video. I am Ed. Uh, in this video, I just want to show you um, how you can enable in-place archiving for a mailbox. Now, some people might say, well, you can go to Office 365. True, but um, there are still clients that are running on-premise servers with on-premise archiving or PSTs on shares, etc. So, if you log into the Exchange Admin Center and you click on Recipients Mailboxes, if you click on a user, you can see that this user here has archiving enabled. If I come to this user, you can see that in-place archiving is disabled. Now, to enable it is actually quite easy. You obviously would have a dedicated archive database for this. So if you click Enable, you click Browse, you can then select a store, I'll put them on Store 1, just so that you are aware that you do need an Enterprise Cal for this, and it tells you here in the bottom to enable this on, on mailboxes, so just be aware of that. And you click OK, and then basically you can view the details of this. Right, so that is how easy it is to enable archiving. Uh, in the next video, I'm going to show you how to find all users with archiving using a PowerShell script because if you've got 10, 20, 30,000 users that have archiving on, you don't want to go through each and every one to go and check the stats. Thank you very much for watching.